Hi everyone, I'm back. I have been gone from YouTube for a couple of months and this is long overdue, but I'm back here and I'm so excited to share with you guys what I've been up to. Um, it's actually all a little bit depressing because we've been doing so many home renovations that are just taking way longer than expected. Um, so that has honestly been about the biggest reason why I haven't been doing YouTube lately. Um, I've just really been focused on my Instagram, my blog. I just want to keep sharing inspiring content there with you guys. And it takes a lot of work to get great photos and edit those photos, style those photos. So I've been putting a lot of my effort there. And then, like I said, our home renovations have been insane. Um, we have been doing so many. <laughs> We've gotten a little over our heads. But um, basically we started with a master bath renovation back in August of last year and everything was going along okay in the beginning but it just honestly got to be such a disaster with contractors and um, product maybe not fitting quite the way we wanted it to. Um, so it was a lot of back and forth, a lot of people in and out of our home and we finally 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 wrapped that and I'm so happy I honestly didn't shower in our master bathroom for six months so we were using the guest bathroom and that wasn't very fun um it's kind of yeah I guess took a little bit more of a toll on us than we expected um just because it's our master bathroom it's attached to our bedroom so just having people in and out of our house all the time just got to be a lot so I'm so happy to be done with that. It turned out beautifully despite everything that happened and we're using it and loving it. So that's the most important thing. But I'm going to share more of that with you guys very, very soon. Um, we're going to do a blog post about it, a video about it, um, just show you everything that we did. Um, it turned out beautifully. So while we had that going on, we um, also started <laughs> another little renovation on our kitchen. Um, if you guys have done any home renovations, you probably know that a kitchen renovation is a big, big undertaking. So we didn't want to totally gut the uh, kitchen. So we decided we would just paint our existing cabinets. We had some hickory cabinets, which were um, light wood, kind of that orangish wood. Um, and we did not love that. We have hickory floor, so it was just floor to ceiling in Hickory and we were really not into that. So we bought this house knowing that we were going to always paint them or replace them, but painting seemed just like the better option. So we decided to start that while our master bath was going on and got to be a lot. Um, we so we started painting and they realized that we actually needed to replace the doors. So it turned in from a painting job to actually a refacing, which we're happy to do. It actually looks much better than we expected it would. Um, we added some crown molding around the cabinet, so it looks a lot more custom. Um, I'm also going to be sharing that with you guys very soon on my blog and on here. Um, we worked with Cambria for the countertops and they are beautiful. They actually did our kitchen and our bathroom. The products that they have are amazing and we chose kind of a marble look. So they're really, really beautiful, but they're scratch resistant and um, they're really pretty indestructible. So we did have marble in some of our other bathrooms and it just scratches so bad. So we don't take the best care of things, I guess. <laughs> and so Cambria just felt like a better option and they are a local um, company. They're based here in Minnesota. so. We are, we're so excited to work with them and I cannot wait to show you guys the products. So that is primarily the reason why I've taken a break from YouTube because we've had all of this going on over the last few months. Um, it just got really intense around the holidays. We were expecting to have all these projects wrapped before Thanksgiving and they didn't get finished until January. So the other piece of why I've been gone from YouTube is that we added a new family member. And if you guys follow me on Instagram or read my blog, you probably already know who that is. But we got another golden retriever. His name is Leo and he's sleeping. He's actually having puppy dreams at my feet right now. Um, he's growing so fast. So we've been just trying to soak in every moment with him and enjoy our time with him. We got him a couple weeks before Christmas and he was about seven weeks old when we got him. And 
He's growing so fast. He's just a, the chubbiest little puppy. He's so fuzzy. I'm going to show you him in a moment. Um, but we've just been trying to enjoy all the time we can with him. We haven't been traveling or anything like that. Um, just because, yeah, puppies just grow up super, super fast. And we felt like we didn't get enough time with Luna when she was a puppy. So we've been taking a lot more photos and videos. Um, you can follow their Instagram account. I'm going to link that in the description box below. But... They're both super sweet together. It's really priceless. Um, so I'll show you him. I'm gonna wake him up. He's so cute. Come here, baby. Here is little Leo. He was sleeping, so he's super, super tired. Um, we also gave him them a bath today, him and Luna, so they're just pretty lazy. Um, he's three months old, and he weighs about 25 pounds. He's quite chubby. Um, he's super cute though. Look how fuzzy he is. Hey Leo, look. Say hi to the camera. Say hi. <laughs> he is like the sweetest little puppy though. I just love him. He's just so sweet. Anyway, we've been enjoying our time with him. He's so cute with Luna. And yeah, he's just so sweet. So he's going to be about 70 pounds, we think, um, when he's full grown. And he's a lot fluffier than she is, so he's losing a lot of hair. Um, but he's going to look even bigger than 70 pounds just because of that. So he's so sweet, and I just wanted you guys to meet him because you've probably seen him a lot on my Instagram, my Insta stories, and my blog too. But anyway, I'm going to put him down so he can go back to sleep. Want to go back to sleep? <laughs> Okay, so besides our master bathroom renovation, our kitchen renovation, getting a puppy, going through the puppy stages, we also took on one other thing. Yes, we are crazy. Um, we decided to renovate our basement. So when all of the renovations were going on in the upper two levels of our home, we actually spent a lot of time in our basement and we realized it's actually a great space to use. So we decided to make that our office space and um, it was not to our taste. Uh, we had carpet down there, the dogs go in and out to the backyard through there. So the carpet was stained, um, the dogs chewed up the carpet a little bit. So we thought, let's just uh, renovate it. We'll put in um, some wood floor. We're actually doing like a wood porcelain tile, um, but we're doing it heated, so that's taken time painting everything, um, redoing the kitchen down there. So it's a lot, a lot more than we thought it would be. Um, Time-wise, price-wise, our contractor left. It's just been a disaster. So that has actually been the worst project to date. Um, so we took a recommendation by somebody and we felt like that guy was not a great fit. Um, he was actually kind of crazy. So you really have to be careful as to who you bring into your house. Especially when you work from home, when you're a little bit younger than they're used to dealing with. Um, it can be a lot. So we're going to bring in some new people that we're really excited about. And we're hoping they can wrap the project for us very, very soon. And then we're going to start using that space. And it's going to be amazing to have a workspace. Because right now, Phil and I feel like we are spending a lot of time working in the common areas of our home. And it's just super hard to delineate um, your work life from your home life and it all just kind of bleeds together. So I'm excited to have like an office to go to during the day and then to come back upstairs and just feel like I have a home again. <laughs> so we're excited about that and we're excited about um, just having a space to hang out with the dogs and that they can be crazy in and we don't have to chase them around because they're into things they shouldn't be, so it'll be a dog-friendly space. So besides all of those home renovations going on, us getting a puppy, it's just been a lot. So um, my blog and my Instagram are my uh, first two priorities always when it comes to work, so I've been focusing a lot of my attention there. Um, Phil and I have been feeling really inspired to create uh, more creative photos and just share a little bit more of our home life with you guys. So if you want to follow along there, I'm more consistent um, in sharing updates there. Um, my Instagram is Mia Mia Mine. If you don't follow me yet, I will put that in the description box below. Um, other than that, I'm hoping to be more regular on this channel. 
Um, I can't thank you enough for all of you guys who have emailed me and asked me where I am and if I'm coming back. So I am back and I hope to start doing weekly videos for you guys again. Like I said, thank you so much as always for your support and if you have anything you want me to share with you guys, have, have you have any suggestions or um, products you want to see or just anything or you just want to say hello, feel free to write that in the comments or you can always email me too. Thank you so much and I look forward to seeing you guys very soon. Bye-bye.